Hello Sagittarius, welcome back to your uh, weekly uh, tarot intuitive reading and let's start by pulling one spirit animal card and see what is the energy starting for you as of the 1st of February moving through the week. Okay, so we have one card and it's lion. Wow, okay. Um, I feel a very strong new beginning. I feel a lot of passion and I feel a lot of confidence. Uh, confidence towards your future, my dear Sagittarius. I feel you are embracing the power of knowing. The power of knowing, it gives you just, you know, the sky is the limit, as they say. So it gives you full speed to go ahead and make your dreams come true. So whatever you are going you know, to have this week, any obstacles, any uh, challenges, you will ba uh, you know, battle like a, like a lion. I mean, you know, you, you really overcome anything that comes your way. Lion, it's it's a power, it's a grace, it's knowing, it's authority. Some of you will be dealing with authority individuals, um, but I feel that you will have, you know, all the knowledge, all the power. You are just like enlightened bolt. Um, and you can, you know, really find the words. You don't really need to look into your pocket. And also I feel, you know, that um, just the motivation is there, you know, the energy, the drive. You are about to say to yourself, go, 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 get it. You know, the world is my oyster. So that's what I'm seeing for you, my dear uh, Sagittarius, starting this week. So let's clarify this energy with my favorite tarot deck now, Light Seers. And let's look into your recent past, um, your recent past, your present, your future, and spirit advice cards, okay? So let's have a look, okay? And one more, okay? So, your recent past, your recent past is that you have found that ignition, you have found that energy, Maybe it wasn't the case um, before, but the recent the recent past is really talking about the idea. You see, uh, and Leo obviously comes into the play overall energy. So you are sustaining the creativity and positivity. That's what I'm saying here. The present moment is Knight of Cups. Some of you, my dear Sagittarius, going to meet a person if you haven't already met. Um, person going to be really charming, it's just kind of uh, swept you off your feet, um, brings, you know, actually I feel this a very nice energy, this, this person, it doesn't matter what is the uh, gender, a, a male, a female, they are very old-fashioned they are romantics right they they will do the picnics uh with you they will surprise you with certain activities they will bring you the flowers they are um individuals that i would say has the old um old values you know family values relationship values who have been actually craving as well to connect with someone who will understand their their um, approach, their, their values, you know, what is important to them. It seems in the present moment, you will be connecting with someone very, I, I say a Sagittarius, it could be as well, um, it could be equally a fire or um, a water sign, your future, uh, king of swords. Um, it's speaking to me about you know, clarity on on your mental sort of uh, um, capabilities. Maybe you will need to make a certain decision um, if you want, you know, to move ahead with this relationship or maybe for you it should be a focus more um, on the work and on your creativity. But you are contemplating, you are looking into this um, Knight of Cups 
um, I would say very calmly, very clearly, not confused, not expecting anything much, just sitting and observing them. And, you know, obviously I would say action speaks louder than words. So you're really looking, you know, what they have uh, more than just to say, what, what are their actions, right? And uh, spirit advice is seven of wands. So I feel that you at the moment are in the Zen mode. Um, you kind of, um, I would say you attracted the person who is coming into your life. Why you are not, um, why you are not really lost in your, let's say, emotions it's purely because you have had uh, in the past um probably a experience where you kind of jumped into it with a lot of love and passion and this time you are like i'm i'm going to be careful i'm going to just to watch how this will unravel itself and the seven of wands for me really it's um no matter what attention I am receiving, I am going to keep and stay calm. I need, I need, you know, to contemplate on my life priorities. What do I want, you know, from this life? And if you look into this card very carefully, this lady is really kind of um, meditating. Um, the focus is in her sort of, you know, stomach chakra. So it's maybe you as well looking into your health. Some of you might actually trying to find the power and the courage um, of understand your your own feelings because at the end of the day our emotion starts from the gut area so maybe you are not quite sure what you are feeling maybe you have you know those butterflies in your stomach but you're not quite sure if you should be um telling you know these emotions it makes you very positive and uplifted um but you're probably feeling, you know, a little bit like I need to contemplate. And I think the the spirit also what is saying, um, if you find yourself lost and confused and not, you know, sure if this is a real thing, if this this relationship, this this you know person who is um you know sweeping you off your feet and giving those butterflies if you're not quite sure just reflect don't rush to make any decisions or choices just relax and really focus what is what is the best for you in this time okay so nurture yourself food you know eat you know good foods maybe as well do some meditation um just nur nurture yourself i also want to clarify this knight of cups and i would like to clarify the the spirit message okay so so the uh, knight of cups um really like i said uh Five of Pentacles, normally what it represents, it represents closed doors, but there is a choice. There is the key and this person can always go open the doors and get, you know, what is behind the doors. But they are making the choice. I feel that this person left the relationship. They made a choice. They made a choice um, between choosing, you know, you or another person. And they decided that they don't want to go after something that is not real they want something something that really resonates and connects to their heart my dear um sagittarius i don't know why i just said i wanted to say leo maybe you really uh, should look into the leo's reading but obviously there is a leo um energy um so i feel very strongly that they made the choice um to choose you to come forward you and the spirit advice we got you know the emperor clarifying the seven of wands and i think you know it's your time it's basically spirit is saying now you are as a leo as a leo right look at this emperor um as a leo sitting on your sort of you know crown we have the probably shack mate um and and uh, sitting you know on the world you know 
what is your vision you know what you want to you are not going to allow yourself to be confused that's why the reflection is so important um, to reflect exactly how you feel and what do you want from your life Sagittarius also we have this sort of like um, a horn say I, I don't know what sort of animal this is but maybe it's connects with Aries so I would suggest also to check Aries reading maybe there will be certain you know messages that connects to you to to your personal message so the spirit is advising you to stay connected you know to truthful uh, self and you know you know you at the end of the day you're igniting the leo energy the emperor you know where you know to take this next step i really want as well to pull one more card from the the fairy heart tarot this is a romance card so why not okay so let's pull one card to clarify yeah okay so you are protecting your heart you are protecting your heart you don't want to suffer you know that you are now like an emperor you you have the passion you have the vision you have the drive and now comes you know this this person who says you know i love you i care i need you and you probably are slightly confused because you don't know what to do um as you equally have those butterflies in your stomach however the advice really is um allow yourself to be happy allow yourself to experience the love if if the love you know being a stranger in your life my dear Sagittarius I hope it resonates with you um this message and I will see you next week take care bye bye